Sometimes my speech therapist will just text me, and it's never like, hey, how are you? How's your family? No, she will text me exercises to do. She texts me 20, 20 tongue twisters. I'm already struggling right now. Ooh. Sally sells seashells by the seashore. Okay. I would say that one's as old as, old as time is old. All right. Who cares about that? Sally's job is outdated. It, frankly, it's, and it's not sustainable. No one is buying seashells. Never. This is how people keep a seashell. They step on it, and they're like, oh, ow, I stepped on something. Oh, that's kind of shaped like a whatever, and then they keep it. And obviously she's selling them by the seashore. That's insane to be like, what, 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 are, you, what are you, some kind of kook who sells them inland? It's bizarre. It's bizarre. Okay, <laughs> Sam saw seven slippery snakes slithering silently. Who cares? Okay, okay. Eh, if if they were actually silently slithering, you'd be dead, Sam. You would be dead. Okay? It was not that silently. Why are we trusting Sam on this? Oh, the boy who cried snake again. Who, oh, yeah, it was it was seven this time? Shut up, Sam. Why don't you get a job like Sally? She's down there selling see, she's yeah, it's not it's not a it's not a real job, but she's trying. No, she's not out there in the woods counting snakes that are slithering. That's what they do. They slither. They, they're, they've been known to not do anything else. Tell me, why don't you tell, Sam, why don't you tell me when, if a snake gets legs and walks, when a snake walks, when a snake stands, then we'll have a tongue twister, all right? If a snake stands silently, that's a serpent. And we need to, and we're in biblical times. <laughs> Susan's sunny yellow sunflower swayed in the breeze. Okay. You couldn't have said swayed in the swing at the end there. I kind of nailed that with the breeze thing. So, suck it. You couldn't have said sunny, silvery. Come on, you're losing S's here. You're losing me. I'm killing this one. I'm killing it. I don't care. I'll meet Susan. I'll meet her and talk about her sunny yellow sunflower that swayed in the breeze. Come on! <laughs> Steven's striped socks are... 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 <laughs> you got me. You got me on that one. Arst, 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 arst. <laughs> I was doing it myself and I was like, okay, okay. Get it, striped socks. Get it, get it. I'm sorry, if the point of that exercise was to turn into a seal at the end? Uh, okay, cool. Transfiguration? Erst, erst, erst. <laughs> Sandy the squirrel scampered up the sturdy oak tree. Who, ta who talks like that? If someone said to me, Quick, that squirrel is scampering, I would, I would kick them in the face. I would hope to kick them hard enough that it sent them back to the decade they came from. Perverts say scampered. You know, this is a person who says the word scampered. Eh, you named your squirrel? And then it scampered? That's a... You, you, you don't have hobbies. That's your problem. Squirrels, squ squirrels go up trees. Look at it, look at it, look at it. I'd be like, yeah, it, it's a squirrel. It goes up the tree. No, 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 that's not just any squirrel. That's Sandy. And it just scampered. <laughs> Sarah's singing soothes the savage beasts. I got, that one's easy. I could just be casual with that one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's Sarah. Her singing soothes the savage beasts. <laughs> <laughs> Scotty's spaceship soared into space. Okay, who is, who is Scotty? And what, you're monitoring your spaceship that soared into space? Yeah, right, bud. Scotty doesn't know. <laughs> Sophie's spiky cactus survived the scorching desert. This is one that I think is actually a normal sentence. I think this is as close to normal as we're going to get with any of these. Cacti and Dubai. That's it. 
I have a headache. The silly squirrel. Okay, we're back on squirrels. Can we can we have something going on in our lives, please, that we're not just talking about squirrels all the time? That would be super helpful. My wife has ADHD. Can we avoid all the squirrel talk, please? I actually think my speech therapist might have conspired with, them, with my wife to come up with this list. This is just, this is too random and yet specific. And that is how you describe an ADHD person. It's random, but it's specific. Samuel's shiny silver sh spoon, spoon <laughs> sparkled in the sunlight. I got older during that one. <laughs> Stress makes you feel older, and that's what happens with Samuel's silver shiny spoon. <laughs> Samuel's shine Sam Samuel who's Samuel who's is that that's a that's the imposter Samuel it's Samuel it's a fake Samuel who are you saying Samuel or Samuel <laughs> who is this voice this is not a real no one's real voice is this Samuel silvery spoon uh, uh, I'm having a vision uh, uh, uh. this is just becoming that mumbling that happens when you're asleep Stars, 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 stars. Su Susie's seven sisters sewed colorful quilts. Colorful quilts. Now I just de-aged myself with that one. Colorful quilts. Susie's seven colorful quilts. <laughs> Did you see how colorful the quilts are? Can we go into the car? Susie's seven sisters. Seven? Seven? You have seven sisters, Susie? Come on, Sus. What are we doing? Get your parents out of the bedroom. Obviously, they sewed quilts. Your whole family is cold because you don't, you can't afford paneling in your home. If your parents, Suze, Susie, can I call you Suze? Your parents, if they had one boy, he would disrupt this whole sewing operation. He would, he would be like, I, what about, like, who cares about cloth? Let's get some sticks in here. Can you have your dad face your mom north, maybe? Try something else. Susan's sweet smile made everyone feel welcome. Okay. Well, that was just mostly a regular sentence. Steve's speedy sports... Sports... We know that you used to have a speedy sports car, but Drew stuttered, and now you don't have any air. So, <laughs> moving on. Sally's stuffed teddy bear sat on the sp sp squishy sp on the soft on the on the <laughs> sorry no you guys are no it's there there's just uh, no it's breaking up <laughs> there's not soft soft soft, soft squishy squishy <laughs> this is me just putting myself to sleep soft Sav squishy sofa. I don't know why I turned into Peter from Family Guy. Shaft? Is that shaft? Shaft squishy? <laughs> Sophie's strawberry shortcake was simply scrumptious. All right. Well, that's I, that's pretentious. That's what it is. How about Sophie's food critic is uh is pretentious and has a uh, fork in his ass. Sophie's strawberry shortcake offensive, was simply scrumptious. Was it simply? I don't think something could be simply scrumptious. Please don't undercut Sophie's, okay? Please don't undercut her work here, what she's been able to do. It was not simple. There was nothing simple. There's a recipe. It's been passed down for generations, okay? Do you know the, do you know the, what, the all the parts that go into a shortcake? It's, it, there's, there's, it's layered. It's genuinely layered. It's like, there's a piece, and then there's cream, and then there's strawberries that are fanned, and then you put another slice of cake on top of it, and then there's cream, and then there's strawberries, strawberries, strawberries on top of that. Sorry, I didn't mean to remix my own shit, but whatever. My uh, my desserts are dope. Simon the snail said, "Okay, I, there's so much wrong with this one. I don't. There's nothing about this one that I agree with from a practical standpoint." No, the sale, the, the snail, the sale. You got me. Damn it. I can't criticize it if I can't say it. A snail does not say that. And a snail doesn't talk at all. 
So why are we personifying a snail? Why? Let's take the most uninteresting animal out there and personify it, and we're going to name it, too. 